Hi guys, my name is Slav and I'm from Handpainted Backdrops UK. So you can follow me on Instagram or Facebook page. Also you can visit my webpage handpaintedbackdrops.co.uk. So you can find a lot of backdrops there. A uh, couple of backdrops actually behind me, freshly painted. I've been photographing today them and I decided to make a quick video as well for you to uh, explain very specific thing. And um, people always when ordering uh, asking me, Slav, can you paint me exactly backdrop when, uh, to the reference when I send it? I said yes and no. I try my best, but it's not two backdrops the same. So basically, when you're requesting same backdrop, it, it, it's impossible to do it. And even if I've been creating the backdrop, it's impossible to recreate the second one like this. Why? Um, I will try to tell you a couple of things about the painting. So when I paint for the stock, I try to create. So I'm creating and I'm thinking about the creativity, what I want to see on the backdrop. When I'm painting for the client, I'm solving the problem. So when I paint and I can see something going wrong, I'm solving the problem here and there. And it could be very different approaches to solve this problem, adding some paint or maybe uh, rolling a little bit more or maybe adding the water or something like this, you know. So uh, these small things is impossible to remember or even if, to, if I will write that down, what I've been doing step by step, is impossible to recreate the steps because that was like very um, here and there, you know, it's, it's, it's not something you have in the system. So my painting usually not go into the system. Usually I'm or creating or maybe solving the problem for the client. I have a couple of backdrops which I'm trying to recreate. So I might build, eventually I might build some portfolio of the backdrops which I can recreate and make similar. But usually uh, I will try my best to do what you want. Always. That's the two things what I want to tell you about the uh, painting exactly to the reference. Um, when you're finding the reference, you don't know it's been color graded or it might be um, been lighted that way, for example, using gels and stuff like this. So the color could be shifting drastically, drastically, and we don't know what the color is. Um, so that's the another, another thing. Third thing, the color and texture will change depending on your settings. So I can photograph, for example, for you the backdrop with um, lens 70 to 200 and 2.8 aperture with model or maybe mannequin and uh, its texture will be blurry. And when I send it to, to you, you will use different light, you will use different uh, lens, and you will use different settings. So you will have completely different look on this backdrop. So it's your creativity. What I want to say, don't look for perfect backdrop. Either from me or from other people, uh, other companies, don't look for perfect backdrop. It's not such a thing a perfect backdrop is your creativity what do you want to create what do you want how do you want to see this image when you're creating that's the main thing and it will be unique to you because it's only you can create this image just with this backdrop just like that nobody else backdrop is unique and your vision is unique so guys don't look for perfect perfect backdrop it doesn't exist. It only exists perfect backdrop for you. But if you see perfect backdrop, other photographers have, it might be not perfect for you at all. It perfect for them, but might be not perfect for you. I will always work toward your reference, but I will never copy the reference. I will create for you the perfect backdrop, how I see and how you want.
Thank you very much again for watching me. Thank you very much for coming to my YouTube channel. So hopefully you will like this video. Maybe subscribe to my channel if you want some more videos like this. And possibly you will share it to your friends. I will be very grateful for that. So thank you very much for watching and I will see you next time on the next video. Bye.